A sigh of relief tonight as police arrest a suspect accused of opening fire at a Kansas City grocery store. Police say that suspect is a juvenile. The shooting happened Monday, hurting two people at the Sun Fresh on 31st and Prospect. And that is where we find 41 Action News reporter Andres Gutierrez. As police made the arrest north of the river, we were here at the store talking to the owner who told me that while many of his employees showed up to work the next day, a couple of them still haven't come back. <laughs> Inside the Sunfresh on Prospect Avenue, customers go on about their business. Among them, a familiar face, Pat Clark. You want to go get me some uh, hot dog buns? The community activist and president of the Oak Park Neighborhood Association shops here almost every other day since the store's grand opening in mid-June. We've been waiting on a store like this for years, and now that we have it, you know, I tell people all the time, this is our store. Whatever happens here, it happens to us. Making Monday shooting so disheartening, the gunman opened fire by the front entrance in the store filled with families. The bullets injured an innocent young woman carrying a stack of grocery baskets and wounded an armed man who police say was the suspect's intended target. At this point, what do we do? We move on. We work to make sure that this don't happen again. Store owner John LaPerry is now in the midst of working with the city to beef up security. Our plan in the first place was to have off-duty policemen here. Uh, that didn't work out from the beginning because of scheduling and stuff like that. But that will be one noticeable change in the near future. Maybe it'll make people feel at ease and you know, feel safe when they come in here. Another reassuring fact. They just made an arrest. Made an arrest. Wow. As we were putting together this story, word came from KCPD that the suspected shooter, a young man, was taken into custody north of the river. The arrest made in 72 hours. Quick reaction. You know, in other cases, a lot of folks just don't want to say nothing, you know. So if this is the guy that they got and this is the guy that did this, I say good job. The store owner says he plans to meet with city leaders and police on Monday. As for the suspected shooter, there's no word yet as to when he'll make his first court appearance. Reporting in Kansas City, Andres Gutierrez, 41 Action News.